We have a follow up to a story we first brought you on Thursday about a lone headstone in Rio Hondo covered by grass and weeds. Well, that grave belongs to Private First Class James Robeson, who died on Normandy Beach during World War II. A group of veterans from around the valley decided to do something about it. This morning, they all went to the, lo to the location to clean up Robeson's final resting place. As veterans, it's our job. We, uh, no one does more for veterans than the VFW and fellow veterans. So that's why we're here. Uh, it doesn't matter whether you're alive or dead, you still serve this country and you deserve to be honored. The veterans that volunteered this morning say they hope people living in the area, veterans or not, will continue to take care of the lone gravesite. Up to a story we first brought you on Thursday about a lone headstone in Rio Hondo covered up by weeds. Well, that grave belongs to Private First Class James Robeson, who died on Normandy Beach during World War II. A group of veterans from around the valley decided to do something about it. This morning, they all went to the location to clean up Robeson's final resting place. All we ask is, is for the community to, uh, to continue, you know, upkeeping this gravesite because I think it's been forgotten for a long time. So it's one of, he's one of our World War II heroes. He, he was killed in action in 1944. The veterans placed flags and flowers plus a small statue of Jesus at the gravesite. They're hoping locals will now help keep that gravesite clean. 